Hey guys, this is uh, Rob Gordy here at Gordy's Boot Camp, and we have Stacy on the right here and Irene on the left. And say hi, guys. Hello. Hey, and they just finished um, the 28 day bikini uh, challenge, and uh, they're going to tell you, give you a couple tips on how they. Uh, did so well. They did very well. And actually, Irene, we'll talk about it in a minute. Um, still finished, even with a broken ankle or a chipped. She's got a chipped heel. Anyway, she'll tell you about that. And she still managed to finish the challenge um, with all the all the challenges. So I, why don't you tell Stacy? Why don't you tell us what happened? What? Uh, how much body fat? I lost four percent body fat, and I did that by eating a healthier diet. So I ate, um, I made my diet about 80% uh, veggies, mm -hmm. um, decreased uh, my fruit intake, and I ate healthier carbs. And I was very consistent with my exercise. And I think that the combination of all of that was key for me to see the success in the 28 days. Okay. So the, the main thing for you, the reason you could drop, it was 4%, by the 4%. way, is phenomenal. And it was you went, you increased your vegetables and started choosing healthier carbs. Yes. What were some of the bad carbs that you're eating before? Do you think croissants that you, croissants? Yeah. Pasta. Right. Right. <laughs> yeah. That'll do it. Okay. Excellent. And how many times a boot camp a week did you do? I did three classes of boot camps a week and then I also was doing a soca size class which mm -hmm. is uh, an equivalent to like a Zumba class but West Indian style. All right so yeah. let's just say most of it was boot camp. Boot camp. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right and then Stacy uh, or Irene that's great Stacy I'm happy for you. So Thank you. And well Irene why don't you tell us uh, what's go how, how did things go for you? Uh, so they went well. I uh, pushed through uh, injuries so super tight IT band which ended up lifting my kneecap All right. and causing grinding bones, which yeah. was super painful, and I was getting over a tendon injury that I'd had for about a year uh -huh. um, on my wrist, uh, so, and then I uh, tripped my ankle. <laughs> right. So, let's, so, but um, it, yeah, let's, so I pushed through injury and still made it. I lost 0.3% body fat mm. and 1.4 pounds, mm -hmm. um, which is exciting. Um, uh, it's, it's awesome. I, I didn't actually think it could happen in 20. Yeah, one percent a month is phenomenal. So anything over that is amazing, like even just incredible. Yeah. And you did it with a, a chipped ankle. Let's just tell the viewers though, you didn't chip your ankle here. You did it. You got hit on a bicycle. I got right? hit on a bicycle. So in addition yeah. to coming to boot camp four times a week, I was riding about uh, a minimum of twelve k a day. Right. Um, as well. So uh, huh. I've improved my cardio and I've cut my cycling time down by about five minutes uphill. Excellent. Uh, Excellent. Yeah. So yeah. doing that and it's been incredible incredibly awesome and I was very I didn't actually think it would work oh yeah <laughs> so I'm like really really shocked and excited that's funny um, yeah okay well not that I but you know sure yeah yeah everyone gets that <laughs> sure everyone's a little skeptical yeah well yeah. So that, you know, that helps for someone news watching, they might be the same way and then and, like... And uh, yeah, I'm just um, listening to my uh, nutritionist actually logging all my meals. So I logged mm. pretty much every single meal. That makes a huge difference in terms of just knowing what you're eating, um, being able to track your micronutrients, mm. macronutrients, um, and knowing sort of how many milligrams of everything that you're doing. So just, um, and uh, also for me, just figuring out um, how to do complete proteins because I don't eat a lot of meat. Mm. Um, so how do I like supplement um, like legumes and those kind of things? So those are really great uh, things that I learned. Right. Um, yeah. Uh, so, so, yeah, the Fitness Pal is a big tip. So, yeah. one thing if anyone watching can use is uh, to grab a My Fitness Pal and start logging what you're eating. Yeah. You'll start learning a lot. Yeah. And, oh, am uh, I supposed to talk about, oh, sorry, I know I'm on camera, uh, about my bench presses? <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, oh, yeah. One huge awesome thing um, I just bench pressed like to like max mm -hmm. 35 pounds, mm -hmm. which is in freaking <laughs> sane. Yeah. It was. Insane. You didn't even know um, you could do it. No, I didn't even know I could do it. I think I started at like 15 or 20 pounds or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, and I went through like 20, 25, and then 35. Right. Um, before I maxed out. So. Yeah, and your your arms were shaking at the end. Yeah. And, and same with you, Stacy. Your you bet your squatted went your squat went from 40 pounds yes, to 90, 90 pounds. in yeah, 28 days. That's pretty good. Yeah. So imagine where you could do in six months, a year, if you kept up this sort of uh, lifestyle. Well, that's great. That's some, those are some good tips. And let me stop it right there.